Unless you are properly trained, you should never exceed your no-stop limits. But the underwater environment is so beautiful we can get distracted and forget to constantly monitor our dive computer. And if we go too deep and stay there too long, we might end up in deco. If this happens, the Pro Plus 2 will promptly alert us and guide us to the surface. Upon entering decompression mode, the audible alarm will sound and the red LED warning light will flash for 10 seconds or until acknowledged by holding the advance button. When entering deco mode, the Pro Plus 2 will display current depth, required ceiling stop depth, required stop time, total ascent time, deco mode icon, nitrogen tissue loading bar, oxygen bar, tank pressure, air time remaining bar. Also, notice the up arrow and deco bar flashing prompting you to ascend to the required ceiling depth. The total ascent time is the estimated time required to reach the surface. It includes stop times required at all ceilings and vertical ascent times calculated for the proper depths. To fulfill your decompression obligation, you should make a safe controlled ascent to a depth slightly deeper than the required ceiling stop depth and stay there for the required stop time indicated. Since the Pro Plus 2 is continuously updating its decompression model, it might happen that while ascending, the required ceiling stop depth and the required stop time might change. In fact, it just happened. My ceiling depth changed from 40 feet to 30 feet and the stop time increased from 8 minutes to 10 minutes. Once you get to within 10 feet of and below the required ceiling stop depth, the Pro Plus 2 displays two solid arrows, a reminder to stop and hold your position. While in deco mode, the Pro Plus 2 has four main displays. To review them, just press the advance button. Alternate displays will revert to the main display after three seconds. Let's look at the main display one. This display includes current depth, required ceiling stop depth and time, total ascent time, deco mode icon, both deco arrows and the deco bar, tank pressure, plus the applicable bar graphs. Let's look at the main display too. Press the advance button. This display includes current depth, maximum depth, elapsed dive time, total ascent time, both arrows and deco bar, tank pressure, and the applicable bar graphs. Let's look at the main display three. Press the advance button. This display includes current depth, temperature, time of day, total ascent time, both arrows and deco bar, tank pressure, and the applicable bar graphs. Press advance again to go back to main display 1. I have 22 minutes left of deco, hopefully some nice fish will come by. If you accidentally ascend to a depth shallower than the required decompression ceiling stop depth, the Pro Plus 2 will enter a conditional violation mode. The down arrow, deco bar, and total ascent time will flash until you descend below the required stop depth. Also, this screen includes the current depth, tank pressure, and applicable bar graphs. Also, the audible alarm will emit a continuous tone and the red LED will flash for 10 seconds or until acknowledged by the pressing the advance button. You must descend below the required decompression ceiling before 5 minutes have elapsed. Once you've satisfied your deco obligations, the tissue loading bar graph will recede into the green and the Pro Plus 2 will revert to the no decompression dive mode. Deco is over, now we can safely ascend to the surface. Press next at the bottom of the screen.